Hey guys! So I'm super excited to announce I now am offering a Learn to 3D Model package. I've had a lot of people ask me how I model things, how I do my tabletop minis and creatures, and I can finally have a great answer and a good resource to go to. So how it's going to work is the monthly subscription either on Patreon or my website. They're the same price, you'll have the same benefits either way. Just depends what you're more comfortable with. And so the way this is going to work is there'll be daily, weekly, and monthly components to the lesson plan. So every day you'll have access to my Discord. I already have about 30 to 40 people part of this early bird special right now. It's currently October, so if you want, you can do this for $8 a month rather than 10 After November, it will be $10 a month only, but there'll be no limit on how many people can join. So the Discord is essentially just for discussing like, hey, I'm working on this, I want some feedback, because um, learning to 3D model is not the easiest thing, and it really helps have a community behind you to, to give you like different tips on how to approach things and stuff. Now, as far as the weekly component, there's two different things I am offering. So I'll have the live classroom session being the biggest component of this. If you can't make something live, that is totally okay. I will archive all the videos so you can go back to them whenever convenient, or just a reference, because honestly, I rewatch videos from people that I helped me on YouTube, a bunch and it's super helpful like wait how did you do that what buttons were you clicking that kind of stuff the lesson plans are mostly pre um planned right now i've written them out from the very very beginning so i'm writing this for people as if you have never opened zbrush in your entire life and then the other weekly component I have is learn to 3D model tutorials. Those are hosted on my website. And if you are a, on my Patreon, you will still have access to all of this. The rewards are the same, once again. So these are just written tutorials. I kind of just pick the topic. If I'm working on something and it was really intricate clothing, I might build a tutorial on how I did that, that kind of stuff. They're not voted on or determined by the community. I'm trying to like, hey, here's a little helpful thing that might inspire you for what you're working on this week or this month. And the last component is monthly. So this is a little more casual, but so you have some motivation to keep working. They're monthly prompts. So for October, that was feathers. Feathers are really hard to sculpt consistently and well, and it's tedious. So you can like do a lot of work and it ends up not looking great because it's the tedious part of it. Uh, but that's a really good topic example for it's great to have feedback from other people. Um, whether I don't do a lesson on it, but I will be posting stuff on the Discord um, under monthly prompt showing how I do it. So I have a little blurb up there right now for how I sculpt feathers, which is a real quick one. And so I'll be doing that for every single month just to get you started. So next month I'm already thinking of either doing clothing folds or scales, for example, that kind of thing. So those are the components of the lesson plan. I am really excited for it. I'm already really impressed by the community and how responsive people have been and just interested in general. Um, I did a survey already to see where everyone is at and the majority of my students so far have zero experience. So if you're watching this, you're kind of considering jump in, but you don't think you're experienced enough, don't worry, no one knows what they're doing. That's where I come in. So moving away from that, let's talk about like my recommendations and what you need for this course. So there's software and a hardware component to this. So that's what's next to me essentially. The hardware, I have this really nice tablet. I'll link in the description. You don't need something this nice. I know it's tempting to buy things expensive, but it's not gonna make you learn anything better. Having great tools can be helpful, but you don't need to spend $400 on a tablet to learn. Um, I learned on a $60 tablet from Wacom Intuos. That's the only Wacom product I suggest. This antiques are way overpriced, just letting you know. Um, there's fantastic $20 or $30 options that will definitely get you going. They're not display tablets though. So display tablet is, this will have my model on it. So I will sculpt directly on it. Now, as far as like it's not display tablet, I will be sculpting, but it'll be projected in front of me, like on the screen. So I'll have to do this and look at a screen. If that disconnect is difficult for you, you will need display tablets, a little more expensive. Now, as far as software, sculpting is sculpting. I mean, you can do the same techniques in different softwares. It's just a different interface. So you can definitely follow along in Blender, which is 100% free. I don't like Blender. They have done great improvements recently. I don't want to learn Blender, even though it looks better now. So just letting you guys know that right up front, don't ask me to teach you in Blender. <laughs> I do ZBrush or ZBrush Core. So ZBrush and ZBrush Core have identical user interfaces. The only difference is some of the features are kind of like grayed out and you can't use them. Honestly, I don't, the, the $700 difference between ZBrush and ZBrush Core, I don't know if I even use the full $700 difference. It's just nice to have the full version and support Pixelogic who made it but you can get by more than get by a ZBrush Core. It is $200, still not a cheap amount of money, so you can do a free trial instead. 
But so you guys know, you pay for it once and it is one and done. So potentially you could get the software and the tablet, like a nicer one for 50 bucks or hundred bucks and have everything you need for under $400, 300 tops. You're set up for life. This isn't the kind of thing like, oh, my ZBrush software wore out. That doesn't happen. These are one-time purchases, just so you guys know. Um, other than that, you don't need anything else. Um, all the lessons I have will keep on backtracking and archiving to have more and more to build upon. So this video is filmed in October 2019. If you're watching this next year, there is a ton of stuff that is available for you to look back on by now. Um, if you have any questions, please let me know. And to everyone who's already part of the package or my tier that I'm doing, thank you guys so much. I'm really excited to teach you guys and I really love doing this. The only thing I forgot to mention is the live classroom session will be between 30 minutes to an hour, give or take, whatever, um, how many questions I get pretty much. Because it'll be live, so we'll be able to ask questions at the end and I will answer those for pretty much as long as needed. So yeah, thank you guys so much and I am super excited to get started. Um, the full launch and the classroom sessions will start in November and I will have four one-hour classrooms starting in November. Thank you so much.